has been a hot minute since we've done one of these together. Hot. Hot minute. And we're not doing anything hot this time. But we are doing, <laughs> we are doing a food taste test. I'm so excited. Yes. So, um, first of all, today is Julia's birthday. This Happy will not birthday. be, this will not be coming out on my birthday. That's, who knows when this will come out. At but the time that we're filming this, it's it is birthday. Julia's birthday. She is 30. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> but yes. So this is a fun, exciting thing. I'm super excited. Um, I got these at Harding's and each of them, I have the receipt, were, it was very smooth. Just, well, thank you. They were $4.99. We'll see whether or not they're worth $4.99. That's going to be the real thing here. So we've got some wild flavors for you guys. There are currently four of them that we have picked out. I will let you introduce these. We have the, first of all, we're trying the bubble gum flavor. And next on our list is the juicy watermelon. Ooh. And then after that is going to be the orange dreamsicle cotton candy. Perfect for summertime. And lastly, because we had to have a weird one in there, couldn't get away with it. And we, Julia's obsession. Yeah. Pickle. <laughs> Pickle cotton candy. <laughs> so excited. I'm so looking forward to this. Uh, these are by Chocolate Storybook. Yes? Yes. Chocolate Storybook. Kind of curious if they have other flavors. Something to look into. Yeah. But what do you think? Without further ado, we should get into this. Let's get right into it. Down and dirty. Let's go. <laughs> Bro. Bro. Ow, ow, that hurt. <laughs> ow! She's attacking the birthday girl. Happy uh. birthday to you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All jokes aside. Let's dig in. Here, here. It does look like cotton candy. <laughs> like, like, obviously, it looks like cotton candy. It looks like, <laughs> like bubble original. Gum. It looks like bubble gum. Cotton candy. Ooh. It's very fragrant. Like, yeah, that smells like bubble gum. That's. <laughs> I did not mean to take that big of a bite. <laughs> My brain is confused on whether or not I should be swallowing this. Because <laughs> <laughs> you're not supposed to swallow bubble gum. Well, yeah, but, but kind, it's just flavored. I know, but my <laughs> brain... It's not bad. That tastes like, um, you know those little, like, bubble gum uh, things, like the candies from our childhood? The bazooka? Is that what they're called? Yeah. Like the little like yellow and blue packaging, like little like rolled up bubble gums. I know what you're talking about. I want to say that's bazooka. From like the 90s? Ed Editor Julia, if you find it, put the picture in here. What would you rate this out of 10? I'm not a huge fan of like bubble gum flavor, um, but it it is actually pretty good for you know being a convenience store cotton candy yeah and like the flavor is there guys like it doesn't taste stale like you get with some like like cotton candy in these type of containers i i find that i can't stop eating it so <laughs> well i'm gonna give it like a Are we rating out of 10? Yeah. Um, I'll give it a 7. Because bubblegum is not like my go-to flavor. But it, it was decent. I wouldn't say like it's my favorite. I'm going to do a 6. It's a little above average. That's fair. Just a little bit. Here's the lid for that one. Next. Did not do the sound when I wanted it to. <laughs> 
is the juicy watermelon. Oh. Oh, you gotta you gotta show them like the top uh, of that. There you go. How it's like kind of marbled I'm in sorry. color. <laughs> I just hit the mic. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Wow. I don't even know what that accent was, but <laughs> I don't either. It has like a really It's a does the the smell is a little um lighter yeah. on this one. It's like not as strong. Not overpowering. Mm -hmm. Oh gosh. No oh, gosh. I always take the biggest clump. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try if I know my best friend that's the face of I don't like that <laughs> I'm gonna try another piece but I'm like I don't know the texture's different on this one you you take you felt that right I feel like this batch isn't like as grainy it's definitely a lighter flavor too like it's not like a punch in the face of watermelon or anything yeah, like they said it was juicy watermelon. That's kind of like that subpar watermelon you get in the summertime where it has like sad watery flavor and you're like, man, that, that was a lot of money to be spending on that watermelon. That's kind of how I'm feeling right now. <laughs> I have strong feelings, so you can't tell. We're a little sleep deprived, so <laughs> forgive us. <laughs> Surprisingly, this video is not being recorded late we just stayed up too late what's your rating mm. i like that flavor i like the flavor better um but shockingly i think i'm gonna have to put it at a six just because like i was expecting more mm. it was a little underwhelming for me It gets a three. Oh, <laughs> it was that bad. I don't know, like, whenever I see something saying juicy watermelon, I'm expecting, like, a punch of flavor. Like, I'm, I'm thinking, like, you know, watermelon Jolly Ranchers. Like, those are juicy. You know that flavor anywhere. Right. Yeah, this one, like, it was decent. But definitely, it was not juicy. Not juicy. <laughs> yes. And thirdly, we are going to the uh, cream, orange cream, orange cream sickle, whatever. Don't <laughs> <I'm> scared. <laughs> I'm gonna break my nail. <laughs> I'm gonna open it like a normal person. <laughs> this <Never>. woman. <laughs> Oh. My head is too round. <laughs> Where's the tab? Where's the tab? Where's the tab? This one does not have a tab. Alright, I guess I, I I can struggle. Oh. <laughs> oh. Sadness. Sad day. It's a very light color too. It's like a very light orange. Yeah, it's almost like, like a, a peachy. peachy. Don't you do it! <laughs> Don't you give it. Put it here. <laughs> okay, I'm I'm done. Ooh. Hmm. That smells like something I've smelled before. It doesn't smell like orange. No. Kind of have like a almost like a vanilla like a but creamsicle. Yeah. So I mean like I guess I kind of understand, but again the fragrance is a little sad. <laughs> definitely like it smells it more familiar, like vanilla. It has a familiar smell. Like a vanilla cupcake. Yeah. Huh. Oh. Mm. Okay. But the flavor. Oh. 
smell not that great mostly because it's not as orangey as i was hoping flavor though that's what i expect like it's it's actually really like flavorful and juicy and i'm down for this you down for that mm -hmm. we're down for this yes oh no that's a huge piece that'd be a lot so rating mm. for this one I'm gonna have to say I would probably put this at I want to say either I'm like stuck between eight and a half and nine just because like the smell isn't like you know what I expected mm -hmm. granted I think the smell has more of the vanilla like dream like cream sickle like like thing yeah but hmm. I was a, I was gonna go with like a eight or a nine as well, so I'm gonna go 8. right 5? eight and a half. Eight yeah. point five. We're both on the eight point five train. Eight point five. Woo. Yeah. We have woo, woo. one more to go. Where did you even put the first one? Down there. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Which I've been super excited for. Pickle. You can just hear the the reluctancy mm -hmm. in, in Michelle's voice over here. No, oh, no. This one also. La, 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 I hear nothing. Oh, there we go. I'm so scared. <laughs> oh. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> it... So, I don't want to do this. <laughs> recently, um, a, uh, someone that came into the job that I work, uh, they actually brought like um, dehydrated pickles. So it was like pickle chips almost. It's, it smells like that. Obviously, like it doesn't have that sweetness, but yeah. You know what? I'm going to give it a fair shot because I like bread and butter is it bread and butter pickles yep the sweet ones not a huge fan of dill i love dill <laughs> so with it being cotton candy maybe mm. it'll be sweet and maybe mm. it'll be good <laughs> did you get the biggest piece? go big or go home you know <laughs> all right cheers <laughs> oh Oh, I'm gonna throw up. Don't actually. You're okay. <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> oh, that was horrendous. It's like they tried to take a dill, and like like I said, they mixed it with sweetness <laughs> to it. Oh, oh. it's not <coughs> <coughs> the worst thing I've had. It's one of the worst things I've ever had. <laughs> Remember the ranch dressing soda? Oh. Yeah, but I didn't almost throw up with that one. That's fair. <laughs> that churned my stomach. It's an acquired taste. We'll go with that. <laughs> like I said, it's kind of like they took dill pickle and like definitely tried to mix it with sweet. And so like, eh. But, uh. Yeah. Well, what would your rating be? <laughs> Big fat zero out of ten. <laughs> Never again. <laughs> I would say, because I do wish it was more of that like sour dill flavor. Like I feel like okay, just thinking about it. <laughs> All right, if I can say anything for this is I wish they had picked a side, like either make it a sweet pickle taste or a dill pickle taste. Mm. Mm -hmm. Because like if they had gone dill pickle, they could have gone more savory, and like if they just stuck with a sweet pickle, like a bread and butter. Like, you know, it would have it would have worked with the sweetness. Um, because it, it was okay. It was not my favorite. What did they rate the, the, the watermelon? Did they rate the watermelon a three? Yes. I'll give it a four. It was better than the watermelon, but it wasn't that great. 
Michelle was like, no, no. So our absolute favorite would be the the dream the orange dream sickle, followed by the the bubblegum. Bubblegum. Yes. Yes. I've, I was a little shocked actually because the I wasn't expecting to like the bubblegum yeah. as much as I did. But like it had everything. It had the really pretty color, it had the great smell, and it had the good, great flavor. Right. This was by far the the best of them all. Yeah. Like it had like which is funny because we rated it lower than this one. I think we were okay. If we had to like re reorganize them because mm -hmm. we hadn't tried the others yet. Yeah. I honestly would put this one first, and then this one. That's fair. I can actually agree with that. I would probably give this the 8, and then give this, like, a 7. Yeah? I'll agree with that. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> have, have a good piece of the good one. <laughs> Get the other taste out of your mouth. Yeah. That's a lot better. <laughs> But I definitely kind of want to see if this brand has more, like, weird flavors. Because I'm very curious now. Yeah, I'd be down. Just, Just no um, more pickle. No more pickle. <laughs> That's fair. Please, God. But if you guys want to see more videos like this, leave a comment down in the description. Leave a comment down in the description. Leave a comment down below. We're awake. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Uh, please remember to like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell for notifications, share with your friends, and we'll see you guys in the next video. All right. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.